I'm Jeff Alpin, the Big Game Hunter, the head coach for JobSearchCoachingHQ.com, a site with curated information you can watch, listen to, or read that'll help you find work more quickly. It's Saturday morning. I'm in a t-shirt today. I'm feeling kind of relaxed. The sun isn't quite up yet over the mountain, and uh, I just thought I'd do a quick video before going off to my day. No BS resume advice. I haven't done one of these in a long time, and I thought I would give you some resume advice because this week I saw a bunch of resumes from people got a bunch of messages from people about their resume and you know the title of this video is stop using BS expressions you know there's a website called the corporate BS generator and I just want to make sure um, yeah it's the corporate BS generator and it starts off with a Dilbert cartoon with the wacko boss basically saying our differentiating value-added strategy is transformational change. And you got to pause for a second and say, what the heck are they talking about? And as you scroll down the site, they have the opportunity for you to auto-generate some phrases. So when I clicked on it, it generated conveniently benchmark-enabled users. If I read across the first line of adverbs, verbs, adjectives, and nouns, it would say appropriately actualize 24-7 action items. Okay. The point I'm trying to make is a lot of your resumes, in the effort to sound professional or to speak corporate, sound stupid. Um, when people contact me for coaching, sometimes they'll say, I have difficulty articulating my stories. Articulating means, speaks to enunciating and speaking clearly versus explaining myself in a clear manner. And thus it begs the question of, you're misusing words regularly. You're using phrases that you think are going to create impact, but it doesn't wind up being the impact that you want. Speak English. Speak simple language, because what you'll discover is it's the people who are stuck in the middle, who don't know how to get up high, who speak in this corporate BS language. I don't care what level of experience you are. If you think about the very senior people in your organization, they speak clearly. They are all understandable. And when you write your resume, you want to have it be understandable to anyone who's looking at it, not attempting to use flowery puff language or stretch out the resume. You want to make sure that you speak in language that is clear and concise and to the point so that anyone looking at it, a six-year-old, can understand what you're doing. Stop trying to be flowery or fancy. Just go for accurate and communicate clearly. I'm Jeff Alpin. I hope you found this helpful. Visit my website, thebiggamehunter.us. I've got a lot there that you can watch, listen to, or read. It's going to help you find work more quickly. Also want to mention, if you're interested in my coaching you, reach out to me through LinkedIn at linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash the big game hunter. Mention that you saw the video. I like knowing that I'm helping some folks. And once we're connected, message me that you're interested in coaching or a resume or LinkedIn profile critique. We'll set up time for a conversation. Hope you have a great day and take care.